yet. We're gonna need more water. We need backup. We're gonna go ahead and take a full serving of Glyco HD. Do this pre-workout, post-workout today with the two heaviest carb meals, just to help uh, shut all those carbs in the muscle. Um, because after my first two or three meals, I'll probably start cutting back on the carbs. You guys know I'm very particular, um, especially particular with uh, brands, companies that I sort of partner with. And uh, one, one company that I've always sort of stood behind and really, really loved all their products, all their clothing is Gasp and Better Bodies. Um, Michael, the owner, is a great guy, shares a lot of the same passions as me. They have Destination Dallas there in Dallas, which we're gonna go visit. Um, and that's an awesome gym. And actually I use that as some inspiration for Pure Muscle and Fitness. So he's a great guy, we get along, we talk about equipment, uh, just in business. And I'm happy that we sort of just created a little partnership and I'm gonna be a part of the team. Um, you know, I already wear the clothing, you guys have probably seen, I always wear the thermos, the hoodies. So for years, like going back to 2010. So I love, uh, I love gas clothing. So if you guys wanna check out their website and you wanna grab anything, um, at checkout, you can just use Dorian 15 and you'll save 15% off your order. Something else I wanted to share with you guys, I just got a message here from uh, Michael at Gasp. Um, Michael is the owner of Gasp Better Bodies. He's an awesome guy. We have a lot of the same, uh, same interests and passions. He has a gym, Destination Dallas. I actually got a lot of inspiration from his gym um, when we opened Pure Muscle and Fitness. Always been a huge fan of Gasp and Better Bodies. Um, if you guys followed me back in 2011, 2010, 2013, you'll see that I was wearing all their stuff all the time. Love the way it fits, love the quality. I'm very particular. Um, so I'm happy uh, to announce that we just uh, did a little partnership where, um, yeah, I'm gonna be doing some stuff with Gasp. Um, and we're actually going to be going to Destination Dallas the week after the Olympia. So I'm looking forward to that. Um, yeah, all their clothing guys is awesome. Like, this is my favorite. These ones here are my favorite. I've worn these for years. The thermos. They have uh, these ones here, and they also have the ones with the hoods. Those are my favorites for training. Throw them on over top of your t-shirts or whatever. Super comfortable. Uh, if you guys at checkout use uh, Dorian 15, you'll save 15% off all your uh, purchases at Gasp and Better Bodies. here at the gym we are entering the back door today so we got to be in and out um, so I got the workout written down here this is sort of a rough idea of what we're doing today we're gonna do a couple back exercises just pump sets we're gonna do two chest exercises a little bit of shoulders superset one bicep tricep exercise and then just uh, a little bit of legs just to Throw some carbs in there. So let's get in there and uh, get her started. Do you know my name? carbs in here because I do a couple sets of legs. So you're just going really light? Yeah, really light here, just trying to get some blood into the quads. Keep them firing, keep those carbs driving there. Not trying to break down any muscle tissue. Do you know my name? All right guys, so that is pretty much a wrap for the pump workout today. I'm gonna do two sets here, and I might do just two sets on the gluteator. Get home, and I'm gonna show you guys my post-workout meal. Keep left to stay on Ontario 403 East. All right, 
So we just got our first coat of tan on. And this is the first time in history that I've got my spray tan and my body's absorbed it and dried within like 10 minutes. So Yeah, you were quick. Yeah, I feel good about that. Back tomorrow for another coat. And uh, I think we'll be on stage tomorrow for the for the qualifying show for nationals, probably around 5 36 o'clock. Oh, that was a good go, right? Yeah, you got yeah. the five guys and then you had the two cookies. Yeah, yeah. And the then you're putting cookie. the one in reach. I was like, why don't you put it in the air fryer? And you're like, no, I'm just gonna put it in the oven. So mm -hmm. then you sit down, and I'm like, he's got a burger, two cookies. Yeah. I'm like, <laughs> that was good, but too full. And then gas. <sighs> So I'm glad we experimented though because I can really find what sits well in my stomach, right? Yeah. And what you got, Cody? I'm just finishing 100 grams of cream of rice. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> the little things. Yeah. <laughs> Where's my what? You ready? Yeah, I'm excited. Yeah. yeah. Good. This is Nicole, right. an AC muscle athlete. Today too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm doing uh, wellness today, and then yeah, tomorrow. Yeah, first so, time in wellness. First time ever on stage. So yeah. excited. And you look amazing. Yeah, thank you. And this is Brandon. How are you doing? Hello. <laughs> so Darren, how was your tan? Oh, tan. Uh, tan was good. Yeah. Yeah, dried, dried nice. Your tan dried good too. Yeah. 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 yeah the product they're using, that absolute touch. It's, it's really nice. Dries really nice. So, so what now are you doing now? Now we're gonna gel the hair. We have a couple cookies. Okay. And we get backstage. Okay. All right. Won't you come and see what it's like? Living by the rules that you write. You ain't all those lavish delights. Now you had no back in sight. All the little lies you recite. Just makes all the savage unite. Usually I'm very polite. But I'ma get savage tonight. You go when that dog be nice. Every single dog gonna bite. You might think I'm wrong, but I'm right. Just let it get a strong appetite. I'ma let it breathe just a little. Keep it to you strong, heavy metal. I don't make a sound when I strike. You better just run for your life. Uh, five guys. Five it's guys. The, probably the best thing. I mean, I don't know. I'm just happy that everything is actually happening and we're here and all of us, the whole crew and like shows, especially after the last like year and a half. So it's pretty cool to be able to do this, especially with all you guys here, you, Mariah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Just tell everyone what the plan is when you take your mask. So the plan now is 
we're gonna go to the hotel room, leave what we don't need to bring home here, because I'm gonna stay at the house. I, I only live like 30 minutes away. So it's only seven o'clock right now, so we're gonna get back. Um, I just had a meal, just like 200 grams of white rice with six ounces of flank steak. Just tie me over. Probably gonna keep the food low. <laughs> have a heavier meal before bed, probably another burger. Um, and just try and come in a little drier and tighter for tomorrow. Um, I was happy with the way I looked. Um, I could just, yeah, just dry up. I think it was about 85%. Uh, we didn't plan on being 100% today, so, because we're on stage in the morning. So we'll make a, a couple uh, manipulations based off, you know, how we were on stage and we'll go from there. Yeah, we'll figure it out tonight. Yeah, yeah, I figured. Yeah. yeah, I feel like I faded a little bit too. I feel like when I first came out, I was a little tighter, glutes and hams and tore because I watched the video. And then through the rounds, just going back to back, I feel like it's so impressive how you are so small. Your yeah. shoulders are so wide. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I don't do, don't do. Yeah, just uh, you gotta tighten up a bit more. Yeah. yeah, I'll dry up overnight do the best I can and go from there. Yeah. All right. Thanks, man. Thank you. You judging tomorrow too? Yeah, okay. I'll see you tomorrow, man. Take care. Everyone's got their uh, weakest link. Fortunately, my weakest link is like one of the most important, it seems, in bodybuilding shows. You know, I got the 3D look, the, the big round muscle and the pecs and the shoulders and the arms. Um, but then, you know, where my downfall is in the glutes and the hamstrings and the tie-ins and getting that skin really thin. And I think it might just be a combination of, you know, not being able to train my legs properly over the years with the herniated disc. And, um, but, you know, I probably could push the condition a little more too. So, we'll see what we can do in like 12 hours, 15 hours. Um, yeah, tomorrow, let me just pull up my, uh, my run down here. So tomorrow, Did you the thing I told you you got to do? Yeah, yeah, I got the instructions. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, so I'm going to wake up at 6 o'clock tomorrow, kick off the day with a coffee and espresso, and uh, let that sort of sit for about an hour until I take a nice poop, and then I'll eat an hour later. Uh, meal one will be 7 o'clock. Probably stick to what I had today. Um, I like the whole eggs, four whole eggs, the fat, so water's cut back. And uh, I'll either do 100 grams of carbs from cream of rice um, or white rice. Uh, but that could change based on how I wake up. So we'll wake up at six o'clock and assess and see what needs to be done uh, for tonight because uh, I need to try and get a little bit drier for the back. Um, you know, at this point we're gonna try and see the best we can drying up from the back but it could also just be a body fat thing too so we'll do the best we could we can um, the back side is always sort of my weak point when it comes to condition so we're going to uh, follow the plan here and see what tomorrow brings Life.